Hi friends, it has been a minute since I've sat down and filmed a plant. Well, this isn't even a plant with me. This is part of a haul. Um, the September haul to be exact. Um, also, I kind of messed up my intro. Hi, my name is China, also known as Sugar Doll Plants or Sugar Box Stickers, whichever you prefer. Um, this is not a plan with me, this is a haul. I don't know what part. I don't know if I had anything filmed for like a September part one of a haul or not. Who knows? But this is either part one or part two of a September haul. I just want to say, um, you might hear my boyfriend in the background, you might hear my dog in the background, you might hear my fan in the background, and I'm really sorry if that is annoying to you. Um, I did not realize my boyfriend would be typing and stuff like that, but we now share an office. Um, this used to be just my office, but now it is, it is converted from a guest bedroom to a shared office. He has to study and I just wanted to film <laughs> so I really should have coordinated this better and you know said I would do this later but I really want to get my stuff put away. Stuff has just kind of been thrown silly nilly willy all over, across my desk. You might hear my boyfriend moving in his chair. <laughs> I did not think this through but it's okay. Um, I love him anyways and I think it's working out pretty good for the both of us in general in terms of like having room to study and work and whatnot. We both work from home pretty much 100% of the time now. So yeah, so you guys might hear that. I just wanna give that little disclaimer. It is what it is. Next time I will make sure I film this when I'm in a room by myself, but for now it is what it is. So um, I have various Happy Mail here. Um, we have the Coffee Monsters Co. Happy Mail. Um, Paper Shire needs to go over here. We have um, Stick With The Plan Co. We have Once More With Love. And we have Rose Colored Days. So I'm just gonna go into the Rose Colored Days first. Just one second. So first thing here is these um, clear dividers. Sorry, I like turned around and like look at my boyfriend to like, wonder why his chair was creaking so much. <laughs> I don't think he can hear me because he's wearing headphones and he's supposed to be listening to a lecture. But um, I got some clear B6 dividers. I have a B6 for my personal and that has dividers, but I didn't have dividers for my B6 for my shop planner. So um, I got them in the clear. Um, this was during the Planner Boss Collective sale, so I just figured it was pretty easy uh to pick up especially with a sale um and then with that came with like my invoice and like some freebies and stuff so i'll show you that hold on let me take my that is my boyfriend's phone i might have to ask him to silence that um but there's this cute october like acetate dashboard i love october it's my birth month it's my babe it's currently october right now and then we have these like DIY date cover overlays. I think these are so cute. I love Halloween and fall and everything that comes with it. The spooky season, spooky movies, all that. It's hard to tell here. Here I'm zoomed y'all in. This is kind of like a sparkly, like a hollow silver or just like a hollow mixed metal type of clear overlays with headers and um, what's it called? How do you say? full box overlay so I definitely keep that because I think I can use that I don't tend to keep the fun fun foiled colored ones and this says you are kind strong capable loved worthy and important and then it has rose colored days information I love rose colored days um but I don't typically like anything rose gold and I don't really, really like have anything to keep these in so I'm going to de-stash that um, I do host de-stash giveaways, you know, quarter, not quarterly, half, semi-yearly, whatever. Um, also, yeah, I was just gonna say, I'm kind of craving, like, having some ice cream. I might have some after this and then work on some digital stickers from Paper Shire that I need to do. But, um, while I was ordering for most colored days during the sale, I knew for sure I needed to pick up the silver, um, Overlay of bougie tapes. I can see my dog like his head is like like looking over at like all of that sound. 
that I'm doing by opening that, but um, yeah, I got these silver overlay, I mean, underlay tapes. I was running low, so I just got silver because I just ordered like gold, I think for like her birthday sale or something. This is a free pen that came with the order. Um, this, I, I mean, it's cute. I, I just usually keep pens like this in my pen cup. I don't really write with them, but let's see. Oh, it writes well. So that is very cute. I love how that wrote. I think it's like a gel pen. I don't know. I just love pens. Um, I also picked up this pen. I have it in black, but I decided to get it in white. It is the Sarasa Dry uh, Drift Grip 0 0.5. And um, I've seen these like available on, um, how do you say, uh, AliExpress, but I don't trust like buying on there unless I use like a gift card. I just... I don't know. Let me know down in the comments below if you've ordered AliExpress. But let me just write a test. There's still a little bit of remnants of that like wax that comes. Zebra, Sarasa, um, Dry, Drift, Grip. 0.5 and so that's how that writes my black one is like a little um like more liquidy than this one so I definitely like that this one is more like you can do that and it's fine um I like that you can you can kind of tell this is a little bit more black pigmented I don't know I'm not a pen expert but I do love pens and I have tons <laughs> ask my mom or my boyfriend or my friends or my family um, so this is a, I got this pen here, which is a uni pen, which is waterproof and fade proof, pigment ink 03. So let's do a test. Um, I heard P-E-N, it's P-I-N. 03. And it kind of smudges. Not that I like immediately do that. Like whenever I write something, I'd probably use it in like a bullet journal. I also am getting a Hobonichi cousin. So you guys might start seeing like that and like hauls, stuff like that and whatnot. But that was my order from Rose Colored Days. Um, moving on. Well, I loved everything. Just to say, just a disclaimer. I'm, I'm very happy with my order. Um, but moving on to One Star With Love. Um, they had, I think, like, th they've been having, like, Once More Love has been having quite a few sales. I think this was, like, I get my invoice. Um, I think this was a sale. But let me see. Or maybe I just decided I had a coupon. Okay, I had, like, a $5 off coupon. I think I had missed the sale, but it was fine because I think my coupon game, or no, there might have been a sale, but I used a coupon because it was, like, more off. So this cute little journal card, I think I have another one of these, but um, so cute with like a little bulletin board and the calendar and the, um, what do they call those Polaroids and the post-its? So cute. Um, so here, <laughs> this part of the order is some munchkin saying, I told you so. I, I'm kind of an I told you so person, I don't know. I got some paper due munchkins because school, even though I don't really have papers, I have mostly like projects that might change like next semester. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. Um, this says, ha ha, it's just munchkins laughing. I thought that was cute. Dishwasher munchkins. I hate doing like most chores like most people do. The one thing that is satisfying to me though is like cleaning the counters, cleaning the stovetop cleaning like the coffee maker appliances pretty much <laughs> um this is uh, this bitch um or this bitch to be more <laughs> appropriate um this is a leg cramp munchkin this is an asthma inhaler munchkin i don't really have i wouldn't really call it asthma i mean maybe i have like allergy like because of seasonal allergies, I have asthma or like I have exercise induced asthma. So, but I don't really have like problems breathing in general unless it's like allergies or I'm exercising. So 
thought that was cute to mark that so that way I know like when I use my inhaler. Like right now I just cleared my throat and I could feel the phlegm. It's you know that time of year. Um, this is the freebie. It says September always feels like a turning point to the rest of the year. And then you have this like ramen doodle, a little ghost mug doodle, a munchkin cooking. I think it's like where it's baking, like fall baking. I'm gonna do some fall baking for sure. Um, this munchkin says rock bottom, and this one says VIP. So here, oh, I don't know. Oh, wait, I don't think I bought another one of these. I just placed another order this past weekend because um, of her baby's one year birthday, but. This is a fall drinks run. I guess I could use this to mark like getting fall drinks with my boyfriend or just by myself, but my boyfriend doesn't really drink coffee, but he does, you know, he likes chai and stuff like that. Um, this is the pumpkin munchkin. I just think it's so cute. I'm so in love with fall. This is the scary movies 2.0. That would be me and my boyfriend at the same time because I'd like to act like I like watching scary movies, and I do like watching like the classics, like Scream. Um, I do like watch Scream is like one of my favorites, um, like absolutely favorites. But uh, I haven't really seen too many more of the classics. My boyfriend was asking me how I feel about the classics. I've seen like Psycho, and I've seen parts of like The Shining. I've seen a lot more. I don't know. I think it's probably fifty fifty. Sorry, I'm gonna take a sip of water. It's probably fifty fifty. Um, how much I watch but I do I've mostly been watching the like family feel good like Halloween movies but I'm going to watch some scary ones then we have these spooky computer munchkins just thought those would be cute to mark work or school work or whatever we have some Halloween TV munchkins and then the Halloween mugs which are so cute so that was my order for more smart love and there will be more to be coming in the October haul. But this is the Stick With The Plan Co. order. And it came with this cute orange, like, how do you call that? Vellum envelope. And then, oh, let me take that. But um, by choosing to shop small, you make a huge difference. Use this code for 10% off your next purchase. And I hope you enjoy using your new stickers. Lots of love. Stick With The Plan Co. Um, and this is what it looks like. This journaling card is so cute. Oh. I'm so happy that she's like finding her groove. Um, I know she had a baby. She tried to like outsource her girl stickers and then she's come up with a solution. You'll see. Um, I ordered some of her stickers and I like her solution. So very excited. Um, we have this freebie, this girl. Oh my God so cute i'm obsessed i'm gonna be putting these like little holiday stickers in my little like so i put them in a sticker book because i barely ever go in there i mean i might but like i might also just put them in my little bins that i store my stickers in and just i don't know have at it so um here we have the let's organize girls we have the one with like the raz cog raz cog cart um or the Michael's planner cart, whatever you want to call it. Even Container Store has one. They have like a mint one and a blush one. I want it so bad, but I just can't justify it. Um, then you have the girl with like her bin of her stickers. That's kind of like how I plan, like how I have my stickers. And you have two of those in those columns. And then a girl holding stickers, which is me right now. So then I got them in the uh, like different hair colorways. So this was um, Stick With The Plan Co Solution because she used to offer, I think, like all of these on like multiple options. I understand her pain as a person who offers like doodles that are girls with like lots of hair. I understand her pain completely and uh, lots of variations. So um, she now puts them all on like one page and you can get like the fun hair girls. So that's what I did. Then I got the like scary movie night. So I definitely have to watch some scary movies. Got the carving pumpkins, nightmare before Christmas. Let's see, Hocus Pocus. Oh, I haven't watched Hocus Pocus yet. I've been watching Halloween Town. I know people say it's cringy. It is, but it is a feel good movie for me. Um, I was raised on Halloween Town. 
and Hocus Pocus, but I think I was more of a Halloween Town kid. Um, then we have these autumn apples. I'm definitely gonna go to a like apple cider mill, a cidery, a uh, brewery, you know, pick apples and do all that. I'm trying to figure that out with everybody's schedules. Then I have digital drawing. Art block is like how I feel most of the time. And I also got them in the different hair colors and you can kind of see the mint green ones. And then I got these spooky laptop girls. Ooh, I looked out for myself. Love that for me. And then I also got them in the fun hair. Then I got the PJ day. Sorry, my dog is trying to get into stuff so I might have to say something to him. This is fall date night. And this is rainy day. And that was my order from Stick of the Plan Co. I'm so obsessed with all of these stickers and can't wait to put them away and also use them. Moving along, we have a massive The Coffee Monsters Co. order because it was Helen's, I think, 21st birthday. Helen is so inspirational. Like, seriously, I just can't. And I had to, like, cut down my cart a lot while checking out because I, I usually just wait for, like, one big sale and just, like, order a ton. But anyways, first things first, we have this um, ruler, which I didn't even realize I had. I got a like a little tiny ruler at Michael's just the other day. And I have some Fox and Pip rulers as well, like acrylic rulers. But um, I'm so excited to have this for my hobo. And I might get into bullet journaling next year. So we shall see. Um, but yeah, I'm just so excited to just have this cute little ruler with all the little like emojis to do all of it. It's just so cute. So on this side you have centimeters and on this side you have inches and it's six inches and 15 centimeters. It's just so cute. Oh, I'm so happy with it. Um, I know like people were like kind of being Karens about like wanting stuff from the sale and like stuff selling out, but like stuff was like, online pretty long for like a pretty decent amount of time compared to like two or three years ago where stuff would literally sell out within like a minute so i understand their frustrations i just don't like how much of a karen people were being <laughs> sorry um all right so here we have some countdown stickers this is freebie for orders 55 and up after coupons and before shipping so you have like countdown from one month, uh, two weeks, ten days, nine days, eight days, seven days, six days, five days, four days, three days, two days, one day. I don't know when I would use this. I'll probably just hold on to this and like keep in my hobo. I need to order some like adhesive pockets. Um, then this is the birthday or no, this is August 21, 2021 freebie. You have the little birthday half box. I think I'm definitely gonna hold on to that for my hobo. The sleep, like the tired, sleep deprived um, emoji, existential crisis, gift wrapping. Then we have some of these like vinyls. Um, there's this phone vinyl. I'm definitely gonna put this in my hobo. It says, in case you forgot, forgot you deserve to be happy. Reminder, recharge yourself before you hit 1%. So cute. Then you have this little um, mushroom one. You have this emoji like with some tea and a book and like doing spa night. This emoji uh, with the washi. I think I'll definitely put that in my hobo as well. Stress depressed, not <laughs> stress hungry and sleep deprived. I'm stress depressed, I'm not depressed. What are you guys, are you guys talking about? And then I heart pens oh, and I do heart pens a lot. I love people that love pens and I love pens. All right, so then here is this journaling card and it says, life doesn't have to be perfect to be wonderful. I love that, it's such a wonderful reminder. And then on the back, um, it's a note, it's from Papa Tater. And it's just like, thank you for celebrating my 21st birthday with me, blah, blah, blah. Um, I think when I got into a fight. 21, that's funny, oh my God. I don't think I've ever heard that pun. Um, but yeah, that was all of the like freebies. Here's the order. So I picked up some more sleepy emojis, some coffee time drip, um, coffee time emojis, the drip coffee. I don't really use my drip coffee machine that much anymore, but I'm definitely going to try because there's these, there's a Trader Joe's like maple coffee that's in the fall and I love that and I need to make some, so. 
I also need to clean my drip coffee maker though. This is the cold brew. This is the espresso. Then we have online class emojis. We have some none of my business emojis. I thought they'd be so funny to mark like tea. Sushi emojis. I was running low on this sheet. Um, like making sure nothing's sticking. Ouch emojis because I'm accident prone. Presentation emojis. Not that I want to do presentations, but like I feel like it's bound to happen. Popcorn emojis. All nighter emojis, which is a mood. <laughs> no energy emojis, also a mood. Oops. Scary movie emojis. Uh, Halloween reading. I don't really read for fun. I'm really reading because it's mandated. I want to read for fun, but <laughs> I just don't have time. We have the autumn working emojis, autumn errands emojis, pumpkin emojis. So cute. All of the like different shapes. Cleaning emojis. I think some of these were like reformat, so I had to get them. Meeting emojis. I have meetings much more often at my new job. Cooking emojis. Baking emojis. Chef emojis for cooking. And then coffee time emoji sampler. It's so hard not to buy all the coffee emoji stickers, to be honest with y'all. So then over here, I think I picked up all the emoji heads. So you have emoji heads part one, part two. I had some of these already, but I was starting to run low. So part two, here's part three, part four, part five, part six, part seven, I think I have this one, part eight, maybe I have this one too, I don't know. And part nine. Then I got these Skype emojis. We don't use Skype, but I figured it works for like Zoom or whatever. I got these so dang excited. Tea lover emojis. Virtual lecture emojis because school. Zombie emojis. Inhaler. I got more inhaler stickers. Pill bottle. Zombie working. Filing tax slash paperwork emojis, which is such a mood. I had to do my personal property tax. I had to do my signing up for insurance because I'm turning 26 and the government hates me. <laughs> um, I did the baking time doodles, multitasking emojis, breakfast time emojis, happy mail emojis. Period emojis, weightlifting emojis, oatmeal doodles. I don't really eat oatmeal that much anymore, but I should. It's a healthier breakfast than like what I have been eating, which is like biscotti and mini donuts. Um, Amazon Prime emojis, milk tea emojis. I love milk tea. Tea time sim emoji sampler, ice cream. This is definitely a reformat. It's so cute. Um, online shopping, BBQ, happy, I thought I needed some more happy emojis, and TV addict emojis. So that was my order from the Coffee Monsters Co. Super excited and happy with it all. So moving along to Paper Shire, and I also have some Paper Shire digitals I have to do. I still haven't finished my Paper Shire digital situation for myself um and for my friend and it's just getting further and further down the year I just really need time <laughs> um but I picked up some paper shire doodles uh this is a I don't know what size this journaling card is it's massive but it's so cute I want to frame it almost or maybe I'll put it on my I have like a bullet bulletin board pin board whatever you want to call it Maybe I'll put it up there. This says take time for you. So cute. I love vanilla. So cute. So here we have my friend Cindy's freebie. I always just send her the freebies. Like, well, I haven't sent them to her yet, but I will. 
Then we have the September Facebook exclusive freebie. This cat is so cute. The vanilla with the computer is a mood. Um, I can't tell if the spinella is, I think it's eating pasta, which is also a mood. I think the spinella with like trick or treat, um, Halloween, these cute little fall Halloween flat leaves, especially this one. The vanilla as a witch in the night sky. I think you could use this to write something if you needed to. And these are so cute. So I always love their freebies. Then you have these, which I'm definitely gonna hold on to. Um, I don't know what I'll use them for. I haven't really used stickers in my pocket in a long time. And I really don't even use my pocket functionally. So I don't know what I'm doing. Um, and then we have this 20 pound orders freebie with the vanilla with like the highlighter. It's kind of like school slash art vibes. Um, and then we have the scary movies vanillas um, that I picked up once again, getting in that spa, spa, fall spooky vibe. Scooby-Doo, I love Scooby-Doo so much. It was my favorite watching as a kid, like what I watched. Then I got the Memorial vanillas. Got the It Vanillas. It's been a while since I've watched it, but um, I don't know. We'll see if I can work up my courage to watch it. I've seen it already, so I know it happens, but oh my god, the second It movie, like the first five minutes, literally, I was like crying so hard. Not because I was scared, but because of like what was going on. So if you if you know, you know. Um, this is the Haunted Mansion. I can't wait to watch Haunted Mansion. I don't know if I'm going to use these to market, depending on the colors in the kit. We'll see. Then we have the Halloween yums. Love me some Halloween yums. Some half Halloween night half boxes. So cute. Definitely gonna use these in my in my bujo or my hobo. Probably my hobo, but that's not until next year, so we'll see. Then we have some Halloween mugs. Love coffee. Halloween candy. We love candy. Um, Halloween emojis. These are so funny and so cute. We have the Halloween banners. Halloween work. The Grim Reaper. That is such a mood. Ghostbusters. I don't think I've seen Ghostbusters all the way through. I've probably seen like the first five minutes and the last five minutes. I think I fell asleep on it, honestly. And then Beetlejuice, which I've never seen all the way through either. I've seen like parts of it when I was at the nail salon one time, like many years ago. So that was my order. I'll definitely make sure to watch um, Beetlejuice and uh, what was the other one? Ghostbusters, if I can. I'm gonna try. Like, I don't have enough time, guys. So, okay, that is it for all the planner stuff. And then we're gonna get into the waxes. So let's go ahead and, um, my camera's gonna cut me off in like three minutes. So I'm just gonna pause here and start over. So one second. All right, so let's start off with these four waxes. These are from um, Salt Mountain Melts. Um, we have First up, we have Cake at the Orchard, which is Apple Cider Donut, Birthday Cake, and Bartlett Pear. And it's, this is what it looks like. Very cute. And it smells so good. I cannot wait to melt that. It smells so good. I, this is my second order from Salt Mountain Melts, and I'm very happy with it so far. Um, then there is Evil Queen, which is Cider Lane whipped cream sugar cookies. And this is what it looks like. Okay. This smells really good. I'm definitely getting like a softer, softer, softer apple smell. Then we have Dirty Dirt Ball, which is Dr. Pepper, Creamy Vanilla, and Cherry. I'm so excited for this. I've smelled them all, but it's been a while. Mmm. This is what it looks like, and it smells so good. I'm not a huge, like, Dr. Pepper lover. I mean, I like it, but honestly, like, unless I get it at the, like, like, at a restaurant, I really don't taste much of a difference in flavor when I drink it in a can. Does that make sense? I don't know. Like, I think it tastes better getting it as a fountain drink than it does to get it in a can. So I usually just get Coke, but I've recently been getting Coke Zero because I'm trying to be good. So this is Old Beach Roller Coaster, which is Beach Nights, Funnel Cake, and Blackberry. 
This is what that looks like. And it smells so good. Oh, oh my goodness. It smells just like a carnival, but with like that hint of blueberry, it really sets it off. So that was my order from Salt Mountain Melts. And then this is hot apple. Hold on. This is L3 Waxy Wonders, and this is hot apple pie sugared shortbread. And this is one of the Bitty Betty loaves which approximately is five ounces. So this is what this looks like, I'll show you. And it's probably all messed up because of me, like, it's not because of them. Um, I think I accidentally, I don't know, it was really hot, I think, when I picked these up out of the mailbox and put them in my car. But it smells really good, very soft. Um, I have like a hot apple pie um, cinnamon rolls. I had a big loaf and I cut it up and it's on my desk. So it's very similar in notes to that, but definitely like softer. Then we have pumpkin cupcake, blueberry cheesecake, cinnamon sugar. And this is what this one looks like. See, this one's fine. And this smells so good. Oh, I should cut some of this up and melt some tonight. Um, let's see. So those were the two Bitty Betty loaves. This is, I don't know how I mess this up, but it's kind of like smudged onto the bag, as you can see. This is cinnamon sugar, cinnamon buns, cream cheese frosting. If you couldn't tell, I have a preferred scent profile. Mmm, this smells so good. Mmm, delicious. Could eat. Then this is blueberry lemonade. I'm not typically a fruit scent lover. I'm a food scent lover, but... I figured this would be nice for my boyfriend. And it smells just like blueberry lemonade to me. Just like it. Then we have some cider donut. Oh, this smells good. I don't know if I get cider donut. I don't know. We'll have to see when I melt it. I don't know if I get cider donut. Or maybe I just don't know what cider donut smells like. This is candy corn. you could say it smells like candy corn like I'm not 100% sure um I have some candy corn it's not my preferred thing to eat as I got older like I care mostly just for like Kit Kats and chocolate and this is cinnamon sticks oh that smells really good it smells just like those like cinnamon broomsticks and like you know cinnamon so that was everything I think or I might have I have a freebie hold on making a mess. I think this is just the only thing in the freebie. I'm not sure. Maybe there's one more thing. Um, this is Gryffindor. It smells very like manly. I like it. Don't hate it. And this is zucchini bread, mac, apple, coconut, cream pie. And that smells really good. Oh, delicious. So that was everything guys. That was it for this haul. Um, I don't know if this is like how long this haul is going to be, but if anything, I hope you enjoyed it. Sorry for all the noise in the background. I'll make sure to not do this next time, but I just really wanted to film and put everything away. So that's all guys. I will talk to you guys in my next video. Thank you guys so much for watching me. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll talk to you later. Love you. Bye.